everyone so last weekend I went to Portland for um, the Pacific Northwest planner meetup and that was really fun being able to meet everybody in person and um, while we were there we got a goodie bag and we were able to do a few make and takes and um, we also did a gift exchange and then we also got a coupon um, the meetup was at a craft store and so we got a coupon to use at that craft store so that was kind of fun and then after the meetup um, well I went to Portland with my friend who's not exactly in the planner community but I'm trying to convince her to get started um, but she just came along for the ride and um, after the meetup we went to downtown Portland and we uh, went to see the International Rose Garden and Powell's Bookstore and then we also and then we had dinner at an awesome place called Killer Burger. Um, I forgot what street it's on but it's somewhat close to Powell's Bookstore. Um, if you guys are curious about it I can find out for you. Well first of all um, the gift I received in the gift exchange came in this awesome bag here and I picked it out because it's a reusable bag and not just a gift bag and because it's a minty color it has teal um, gift paper or tissue paper um, so one of the make and takes that we had was this little um, like a pencil pen holder and it was clear and I just covered it with a teal washi and they added these little like uh, rhinestones around the tops and bottoms and then um, I wanted to make something that I can actually use in my or that actually matches my room and so um, yeah I made that and I think it's kind of cool. And this was our gift bag. Our other make and take, or another one of our make and takes, was pencil, and we just covered it with washi. Just super simple. This one I used a peach colored washi, a striped washi, and then this one's a teal one. And um, both of these washies, they come in a set of maybe 10, and it's a nice thin. Um, then washi it's good for planners. I didn't purchase it because it's $20 for a set of 10 and I that just was not in my budget but I wish I could have gotten it. I think it's by like Doodlebug Designs. I'm not positive. We also made these little paper clips here. as well as these ones with ribbons at the end. Is that? Alright, and then we received this Sabilo. Oh. It's a fine point pen. And it's teal or mint. That's kind of cool. And we have these little doilies. Um, each gift bag was themed a certain color and um, they had pink, purple, lime green, and then teal. And I actually got the pink one and then the girl sitting across from me got the teal one and she actually wanted to switch so I ended up switching with her. Because um, I love pink but right now I love teal so much more. Um, and so there, we also got these little rhinestones, uh, what do you call them? Sequins. Yeah, we got little sequins here. So that'll be fun to play with. I don't know exactly what I'm going to do with that, but I'm happy to actually have it. And then we got these little enamel dots here. Those will be fun. And these little, like, label chipboard label pieces. Got some washi here. I think this is the thin one. 
Yeah, this is a thin one I mentioned. And then we just got a bunch of uh, 4x6 and 3x4 cards from, I think, Me My Big Ideas. So like that. So there's all of that we got. Just a little sample. And then we got these little, um, it's not exactly washy, but they're like little stickers. And there's strips and then um, circles. So that is that one. And then we also got these little, I think they're like little post its. So there's those. And the little pencil ones too. And then we got this little badge that says I am. And then it has a uh, craft warehouse simple stories on it. And I haven't filled in my name yet, but this is what mine looks like. And then we got a demo of um, the mink machine. I think it's the I have no clue who makes it. I think Heidi Swap. Um, it's like a laminator that will turn um, foil or turn your cards to have foil pieces. I think it's kind of cool. Um, I'm not sure if it's something I will get in the near future, but I think it'd be fun to put on stickers. Um, but yeah, so this is the pink foil. And I saw the rose gold one, and that one was pretty nice and then also the the teal colored is nice too okay and then I also got this little thank you card from Stephanie and Christy and they were the hosts of the, um, the planner meetup and that was nice of them to include that and then um, And then one of the members of our group is Studio L2E, and um, she makes these amazing stamps. And I've seen these um, on other people's videos before, but I haven't had a chance to use them just because I don't have money to purchase stamps right now. And so it was nice of her to give away these to um, each member in the, the meetup. And I chose iconic um, stamps, and it just has a bunch of little, nice little icons. I got it mostly for this water bottle because I've been I love using this water bottle. And then there's just a bunch of other ones you can use. So thank you so much for that one. And then I don't know who gave me my, um, or I don't know who whose gift this is, so if you're on YouTube and this is yours, or if you know whose gift this was, please let me know, because I'd like to give you a personal thank you for that. And so, again, this is my gift bag. And there is so much in here. Um, it was a $15 gift, but I'm pretty sure this cost more than $50. But I am very appreciative of it. Okay, so just to go through these somewhat kind of quickly, um, this is Kaiser Craft. They're uh, little stickers with the bonus pocket, the six by eight pocket. And then I got all of a lot of these um, Mombi stickers, and they just look like this. That one. And then this one is Pebbles, and it looks like that. And then I have these Capture Notepad inserts from Basic Gray. That's kind of cool. 
All right, and so this is something that I've seen from TJ Maxx before, and I've already opened it because I was excited to look at it, um, but I never purchased it, so I'm glad to have it now. Um, it's this pack of post-its. This one's the normal, like, square size, and these are little ones. They have, like, little uh, telephones on it, and then these top ones are smaller ones and it says to do don't forget and then the two pattern ones right there so i love these and then i got these cane company smash divider tabs not sure how i'm going to use these yet but i'm excited for it and then i got this um, pack of eight uh, washi tapes and they're all in a teal and lime green color oh and it also came in this little um, bag that says do fun stuff so that was kind of cool and so I got this little um, washi tape and it looks like that and then I got a bunch of little things here. Um, here's some wood veneers, gift tags, um, paper, uh, they're paper clips made out of paper. Um, some bigger tags, more tags, um, more paper clips made out of paper. Um, ATC seeds which I would use them as journaling cards and mini tags and a lot of these are road trip themed especially that one um, so I thought that was kind of cool it's almost like this bag was made for me I don't know and then there's this little envelope here and there's a paper clip from pigtails and pockets it's a little donut and then um, I got these little um, clear stamps and then some emoji stickers and some pineapple stickers from It's Planning Time and these are super cute. I love those colors. Alright, so that's everything I got from the actual meetup and then I did some shopping afterwards. I sucked my budget so that was a good thing. Well, outside of planner stuff, I just stopped by Old Navy and I got um, two tank tops because they were half price for only $5 each. And I always need new black ones, so I got that. And then I also got a minty one because I don't have a mint one yet. So, um, yeah. Okay, so from Craft Warehouse. I got the Snap Studio um, Simple Stories pocket pages. These are the 3x4 ones, and I've been using these for my listers. Got a list, which I need to catch up on. Um, but I ran out, and so I got these ones. Alright, and so I also got these Jelly, jelly Bean Soup 6x6 um, six six mini paper pad, and this is a sightseeing stew. And, um,. It looks like this. It still has the seals on them, so I can't really show you guys. But this is just the pattern. Um, this was on sale for $2, so that was fun. And then I picked up two of these um, dot adhesive tape runners for $1.99 each. Um, I'm on my last one right now, and so it was good that I found these. And then I just got this little dollar spot stamps. Um, I do have small stamps like this, but I like the font on this one more. And so um, I decided to get this one. When the new, um, for my planner, for my Erin Connor planner, I've been loving the morning, day, and night. That's the reason why I got it. But then, um, you know, after time and evaluating the boxes I realized that I could put them to better use with different um, sections like most people do and so when the new one comes out instead of 
creating labels I just want to stamp it that way you don't have to use up so many labels um, I still need to buy good ink for this I might get like some colored ones or something but um, so yeah so for the next next year's planner this is what I'm gonna use Right, and I have so much washi and I do not need to be buying washi however um, I've seen this one on other um, videos and I've been wanting it and I've never found it so far and so this is the little grass let's see if I can Right, it looks like that. I don't know if you can tell, but it's a grass, um, it's a grass washing. I thought that was kind of fun. And this is from Doodleblog Designs, and this is the same one as the, um, the little striped washi I showed you earlier. And then this one, uh, most of the items I got were on sale, except for this one. I could not pass this up because I've never seen it in person. And um, these are the little bee washi tapes, and they're super tiny. Um, there's two of them here. And so they're just super tiny. Um, has They both have arrows on it. They're the same, but I just couldn't pass these ones up. Like, I don't, I've never seen anything like this. Alright, and then I did get some stickers, which I don't need, but... Um, these are mostly all puffy stickers, and I love puffy stickers, and so I got this one that's, um, I don't know, maybe woodland creatures or some kind of little something, I don't know, but I love this little bunny right here, um, but these ones are puffy, and I just got these little hearts ones. And these won't be in my planner because they're dimensional, um, but they will be in my project life. And this is kind of in advance, but these are cute little um, snowflakes. And then I got these pandas, which I'm not sure what I'm going to use them for. Maybe for a planner, because they're not puffy, they're just flat. Um, so I might use them for a planner theme or in my project life. I'm not sure, but they're super cute. So that's all the crafty things I got. The rest of it is just um, a bunch of random things. So like I mentioned, I went to the International Rose Garden. And if you guys have been on my Instagram, you have seen my magnetic board that I just put up. And I put up all my um, magnets that I've been collecting over the years. And so... Um, at the Rose Garden, I found this magnet here. It says Portland Rose Garden, Oregon. And this one I thought was kind of cool because it looks like one of those, um, like, photo canvases that you would get. So it looks kind of cool. I've never seen one like this before. And then, like I said, I went to Powell's Bookstore and I just picked up a couple of books. Um... Yeah, I've been trying, I've been, I've started to reread, um, the Sticky Stack House books, and I finally found number one and two at Powell's, so I was so excited about that. Alright, so I just chose the winner for my giveaway, and the winner is the one and only Grand. So please, um, I will message you, but please, um, make sure to write me back with your address so I can send you the items and I actually won't be sending them in that Erin Condren box that I had originally planned just because I think it might be cheaper uh, on shipping to send it in something else so sorry about that but um, I'm sure you will love what's in the package so I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and I will see you guys next time bye